Okay. About you know, a couple months ago, House Phone was going through what he was going through. Yes. You know what I'm saying? You know, his mom, this is, oh, you know, RP to his mother. RP. He was he was looking for a place to stay because, you know, the landlord where he was living said mom's passed away. So they, you know, they said it was when he evict him. Yeah, but House Phone wasn't on the lease. So he wasn't on the mm. lease, you feel me? So they was, you know, they basically told him to get out. So bro, and you know, not to you know, not to say it like that, but bro, you know, he had a, he packed all his shit. He had all his shit in his car. You feel me? So originally, he trying to find a place to stay. He hit me up, and he like, hey, where you at? He wanted to come get some, you know, some blue chews and shit. I'm like, hey, pull up on me. You know what I'm saying? And I see all this shit in the car, and I'm like, bro, you good? Like, if you need a place, you know, what I'm saying a couch to sleep on, or whatever, nigga. Hey, come, on, you know, come chill for a little bit. He like, no, he, he like, no, nah, I'm good. You know what I'm saying? And then you know. Me and House Phone be having personal talks a lot. So when he go through shit, he be calling me, you know what I'm saying? If he, you know what I'm saying? So when he hit me, one of the days, he was like, hey, he felt a certain way, you know, about Pot Lord. Cause he, you know, cause he felt like he was getting dodged on when he needed a place to stay. You know what I'm saying? And you know, he said it yesterday, he broke everything down. I ain't gonna repeat everything verbatim, but he felt a certain way about that shit, but he didn't let nobody know. He told me, he was like, hey, bro, I don't fuck with that. You feel me? And I'm like, tell him, I'm like, you know what? Just holler at him, you know what I'm saying? That's your homie. I don't think the nigga on some weirdo shit with you and shit like that, but I only knew about that. So when I went to Vegas, you feel me? I I ain't post up that I was in Vegas and shit like that. He hit me, he was like, hey, and then mind you, you know us going on community clips and us saying shit, bro, and we laughing and niggas like, oh, we everybody laughing at Pot Lord and all type of shit like that. I'm like, Nigga, you still the homie, you feel me? I don't want you to think niggas don't like you or don't fuck with you no more because you don't work here no more. So cuz hit me, he like, hey, like where you at? So I'm like, hey, nigga, pull up to my hotel. So I go in the lobby, you know what I'm saying? Palora Alley, I'm over there chilling with them, sipping some wine, and they on stream. You feel me? And they just asking me questions and I'm telling my story and shit like that. But <clears throat> Palora said, yeah, he said, yeah, when I was, you know, house phone was going through a shit, I offered him a place. You know what I'm saying? And I told him, I'm like, nigga, that's what you're supposed to do. You know what I mean? If that's your real homie, you're supposed to do this. But at that moment, I ain't about to sit there and be like, oh, House Phone felt a certain way while we on live to the people and shit like that. That ain't my place to sit there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but now your story to tell. No, but it ain't my place. If House Phone told me something in secrecy, I ain't supposed to go out there, nigga, for the people and be like, oh, nigga, nah, nigga, House Phone said, ooh, ooh, that's some messy shit. You feel me? Right. So House Phone seen that clip and he didn't appreciate that shit. So he came on a Tuesday show yesterday, and, and, he, and he, he addressed the whole situation and shit. So, yeah. Oh, now this is coming like all the way. It makes a lot of sense now. <laughs> Look, go ahead. I know go where ahead, you're going. Joe. I mean, it just makes so much sense. I'm that, getting high too now. I'm sitting there like, <laughs> yeah, it, 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 out, out. it makes Can I assume so what you're gonna much say? sense. What, what? Can what, I assume what you're gonna say? What you gonna say? Or what you're thinking? Well, okay. Is that why they fired him? Wow. Wow. I don't even know what they talking about. I don't even know what they talking about. They don't even make no sense. Is this nigga Blas? Hey, is this nigga Blasy really a gangster? (laughs) Wait, wait, where are we going with this? Because that nigga, house phone made that nigga do the dirty work. (laughs) You fire. <laughs> We're high, bro. We're high as shit. You do it. Josh, and Blasi like, I'm gonna Josh, do it. Josh like, yeah. <laughs> and I'm like, that's crazy though. But that is kind of fucked up though. You know what I'm saying? If you got, but does he really got rental properties actually for him to stay? He probably didn't have it. He probably didn't. I don't know. Well, the, didn't. well, the problem was he said what he was told the price was. It was a different was, price, but it. It right. was hey, being it was getting put in both public. Both of y'all lost. What are, are both of you guys lost? <laughs> Let me put cheap. this in in context. No, you talking about <laughs> house phone and the boy, the other nigga. What you talking about? Bro? Okay, yeah, he was in right, Vegas, ahead, nigga. Okay. The nigga was live the nigga, on the stream. Yeah, the nigga okay. said something about house phone. <laughs> I think, I think, I think, okay. I think the part that upset him was that <laughs> he, was he like, told yeah. he told the house phone a certain price, and then they posted. A certain price on their story. That, that was a thousand dollars less. Less of what they. So if I tell you three thousand dollars and 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 you, and you and you putting it out on Instagram for two thousand. That's what House Phone said. He didn't fuck with that. Wow. So they had a rental property that they wanted to get rented out for a couple thousand. And House Phone was telling them, I want like, it. I, I want it. Three. No, 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 no. Just, no, House Phone no, said, however much it is, 
I got the money, just let me know. And, and he it. said, Pa Lord told him a certain price. And he said, okay, I will pay that price. And he, he felt like he was getting the runaround. And then he seen Allie post up the rental property with a thousand or a price that's a thousand dollars less. That's what Paul Lord told So basically he put a back end tax on him. Yeah. So basically no, it sounded like, <laughs> like he didn't want his ass to live there. That's it what it sounded sound like. like. So it that, sounded like he didn't so want his ass to there. live there. So, so that was house for How can you yesterday. tell your homie that? I don't want you to live in my shit because look, you're irresponsible. Look, yeah, you gonna no, fuck my shit up, fam. No, but at least be a nigga. At no, least, but let's be honest. at least be up front and be like, you know what, bro? I don't want this to get in the middle of our friendship and shit like that, nigga. This some business shit. I I I, I, can't, I can't have you do here. It. Now, well, just finesse. Or, hey, bro, somebody else got this shit. You know, or I some, wish I could have helped you, but it's already gone. Or bro. or be like, you yeah. know what? I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you but sleep he in say here. That, I'm gonna let you stay in here until I got somebody that can book this motherfucker that, out. You know what I'm saying? That, for yeah, at least give a nigga point, some bro, leeway. That's what that's what I would do. That was house phone point that he didn't tell him any of that. He was just kind of beating around the bush about it, like. House phone would ask him, ask him, and then he would just kind of go around. But but honestly, like I'm gonna just be hundred percent honest. Like if like if I had a homie and obviously house phone doesn't have the best reputation. I'm not saying he don't got it. House phone's a good guy. I'm pretty. He's getting back to it. He's, right. But like if like if I have a homie right that misses a lot, sometimes forgets shit, and I'm, and it's not saying they don't got it, just about forgetting shit. I'm I'm gonna kind of be a little iffy, but I'm gonna let him know hundred percent. Like hey, if I'm cool, like look, you're my boy. I love you. Yeah, Maybe we real. could figure out another situation. But I just feel like, you know, you feel me? Because I could fuck up my credit. If, if, if I'm still paying it off while renting it to you and you don't got it on time and I'm wasting my money on other shit expecting your money, then credit and situation, then they could get messy between friendships. Yeah, but be upfront about it. If that's, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm that's saying. That's you know what I'm saying? What I would do is be upfront about it. Like, hey, this is what happened. Because you put yourself in house phone <laughs> shoes. If, I, if this supposed to be my best friend, nah, this ain't no regular homie. Right, this right. ain't no coworker. Like your this is somebody like my brother. Well, first of you all, know what I'm saying? Do, we, do we end right. our friendship there if you my best friend and you tell me you can't give me an apartment and you got that motherfucker online, nigga, for a cheaper price than and you? And I'm going to laugh at you like, man, cut it out, fam. You know I need this bread, man. Sit for all back, bro. We're going to find something else for you to do. But do if you, if, yeah, but if, if if a nigga beat around the bush and don't give it to you, do you end a friendship? Fuck that, bro. If you no, my you, best friend, yeah. I mean, if you yeah. feel, if you feel yeah. entitled, if you feel yeah. entitled, so you know how the nigga feel about you now. Yeah. He don't give a fuck if you got somewhere to sleep or not. Basically, damn, yeah. Yeah. That's, <laughs> deep. that's deep, that's deep, so, deep. You know, but what I'm saying, bro, that's what I'm saying, bro, what I'm saying, bro. Example, bro. Shit. That's deep. For if you my best friend. I should have to ask you, should I, like, if you know that I'm going through it, even if I don't right. want to rent it to you, come sleep in this couch for free, motherfucker. See, and that's you why- You know what I mean? See, like, and that's why I'm a motherfucker that tell you shit up front. I'm a nigga that mm -hmm. don't beat around the bush. I'm a nigga that's going to see- I am the fire starter, but I, I'm i also the nigga that ain't finna do none of that old wishy-washy shit. The flames shit. ain't gonna go too high. I, 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 look, yeah. I'm finna tell you how it is. That is if true. You, if you a nigga, and, you, and I got the smile to tell a nigga, look, check that. I would've broke it all the way down. You bullshit, nigga. But look, you gonna have this spot. <laughs> right, right. Nigga, you gonna get your ass up out of here on that eighth, nigga? Or I'm gonna kick your motherfucking up ass up out of but here. But keep it, you but keeping you, it G. We were being honest. You I gotta, think. you gotta learn how to do that shit nowadays, nigga. Cause oh, you ain't, gonna, you can't even be out here soft talking to nigga and all of that old no, shit. You are gonna put yourself in a hole. You gonna yeah. look like you're gonna be and, 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 and it ain't he like, his, and, and it he ain't put like himself the, in a hole. It ain't like the homie was broke. He doing his thing. Nigga lost his mom. You feel me? So not oh, only so, uh, is he right. going through something emotionally, right, right, you right. feel me? Tragic. That's, right. could, that's why you really don't want to get involved right now. Yeah. Because he's going through something. You don't want to mix your business with his mental. So yes. the answer is no. I love that's you. Valid. Why don't you get your shit together? Let me help you go over here, get this apartment over here, probably pay it up a couple months, bro, and you know, get your mind right. But let me yeah. do it over here. Let me handle this because it's stressful. And I don't want to stress you. How could you just lost your mom? I mean, we even broke it down about four or five things he could have said, <laughs> and but the nigga right, didn't right. say nothing. Yeah, know that's know wild. And that's fucked that's up. That's disrespectful. Yeah, that's I ain't gonna lie though. I ain't gonna lie. Just me. Yeah, bro. I'm. Yeah, I ain't fucking with you no more. Yeah, that's I like, no cap. Nah, yeah. well, bro, I, I needed somewhere to stay and. No, just don't, no cap though. Are you fucking with him? Yes or not? If that was a friend that didn't. Nah, hell. And that was my homeboy. Nah, nope. A nigga nah. be like that. Cancel nah, Christmas. Not if I'm it's fucked up. Right? Cancel Christmas. 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 Bro, bro, especially like, bro. And I'ma <laughs> rob <laughs> your <laughs> ass. And I'ma be catching your ass. <laughs> Were you trying to rent it out to my fucking? I'm not Chicago mentality, right? <laughs> 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 the first when they come to the Ubers, I'ma just catch your ass. You know, it's a stick up. I'ma be cool. But that's crazy. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to do it. You know what I'm saying? I don't. And that's their relationship. How Lord is cool, you know what I'm saying? How's for cool. But if a nigga did me like that, hypothetically, but my homie did. But see, me like it's that, a it's, it's a it's a difference, bro, from nigga. Now if I call you my brother, nigga, I'm gonna go to the end of the world for you. You yeah, feel me? So. Nigga, you bro, I got 
Nigga, almost all, got, all my homies can tell you, nigga, they could sleep in my house, nigga, back in the day. Nigga, granny let the homie stay for a year. I didn't let homie stay two years. Homegirl stay years. She used to Wild do that shit. Yeah, but I'm just damn, they're ready to put your ass out. But bro. I'm just, but I'm just but saying that type of nigga. That's the type homie, of nigga yeah. I am. That's the type of that's how right. I was raised. My granny let thirteen families stay at the house rent free oh, when they was going through hard times. So that's no, what I know. No, so when real. people and this is people that she ain't even know like that and barely know. So if it's somebody I consider my brother. Man, fuck, fuck, fuck this bitch, fuck, fuck who the landlord, fuck all that. Hey, bro, take the couch, nigga. Whoever don't like it, don't they don't fuck with a nigga. Then that's how you supposed to be. Right, that's if right. I consider you my brother. And he got right. some you bread what I'm too. It's like he going like I know you gonna pay me. Yeah, he ain't he ain't bumming it. You know he got right, a paycheck right, right. coming so through. That, yeah, that's different. You know what I'm saying? It's right. different. So now you got to question the friendship. Was you really my my friend type shit? Because everybody ain't your friend because you hang out with them and you've been knowing them a long time. It's gonna yo you gonna see who your real friends is when you're back against the wall. Mm. You feel me? Who gonna be there by your side? You feel me? Mm. 